Welcome back to Science Fun for Kids. Today, we're going to do an experiment called air-powered balloon car. Friends, the things that we're going to be using are the things that are available in our house. So, the things are a water bottle, four plastic bottle caps, some skewers, A balloon, some straws, and also tape. We're going to make two holes in the bottle. One on the top and one on the bottom. And these steps require adult help. My uncle is going to help me put the holes in. in the bottle caps too. Now we're done making the holes. Next, we're going to insert the wooden skewers in the bottle cap. Look at this, guys. And now we're going to do the same thing. Now we're going to put the straw inside the bottle. Friends, I added the straws in the plastic bottle. And now I'm going to trim the straws with the scissors. Friends, look at this. Friends, now we're going to take the skewers that we made and put it inside the straw. going to take another bottle cap and put We're going to trim this again. We're going to do the same thing on the front. Put it through this straw and we're going to take another bottle cap and put it through. We're going to trim the excess on both of them. We added another hole on the top so we can put the straw inside. We're going to add some tape to secure the straw. We're going to add the balloon on top of the straw. Now we're going to add tape around it. Stuff. And 
Now we're done creating the balloon powered car. So next, we're gonna blow the balloon up. Let's see what happens. Do you know how this works? The balloon powered car is pushed forward by air escaping from a balloon. It works by Newton's law of motion. Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. When we inflate the balloon, the air comes out of this direction, creating the force to move the car in the opposite direction. I hope you liked this video. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe to Science Show for Kids. And don't forget to hit that bell icon so you will get notified when I upload a video. Thank you and Nandri.